Hello everyone, and welcome back to EO4 Plagueis Kiev. Let's continue. So, last episode we failed, <laughs> got an next, so a good old restart will do. We'll see. Let's start by putting a merchant here, as I forgot last time, and a merchant here to collect. And let's see. Well, we'll see what happens with Lithuania last episode, or yeah, the last run. They... Or Poland didn't say yes to the Commonwealth. Let's see if that happens now. I believe I will become the vassal of Poland if they say yes. I'm not 100% sure, to be honest. So let's see what, what happens regarding their rivals and such. Um, right. Bardic. Suppose that's how you say it. Badish, the Bardic infantry. I'm assuming it's Bardic, but I could be wrong. So right now the rivals to Lithuania is Teutonic Order and Muscovy. All right. No, they went with their local choice again. What? Really? <laughs> okay. Well, all right. Interesting. I think I sort of wanted the uh, I sort of wanted Poland to take them on, but hmm. All right. Poland and Novgorod. Lithuanian Raishan. Okay. Uh, Mikhail, right. I'll do it. Eighteen. Yeah. Mm. Zero three three. That's very bad. Let's take five 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 here. I built to the force limit, if possible. Damn, that's a good general. Four, six, five, two. Jeez. Stefano Schengen. So, no, it's not the leader. Commodus. Hmm. Commodus down here as well, right? Yeah. Trebizond. Alright. Guess we'll bide our time. See what will happen. Hopefully. Okay, you're fighting Novgorod, but not hmm, Lithuania. Must be because they attacked someone else than uh, Novgorod. Kashin. Oh, that's Tver, I think. Tver. Yeah, okay. We're just gonna chill, wait for some kind of uh, perfect opportunity, at least to some degree. The <laughs> the Mamelukes. You're really f far away, but uh, maybe you could get access. Guess we'll find out. Okay. You would war, but not too far off if that you want to help us. Might have to hire a 
diplomat guy. Let's uh, fire you. Okay. Buy him now. I guess I'll do it. Now, if they really wrecked Novgorod, they might not help Lithuania if we went to war against them. Independence war. Might be too much to ask, but still. Teutonic order. Would you assist? No. Too many relations. They must be right. Nope. Take the prestige it. Do this again, though. Let's uh, send a merchant. Merchant? Diplomat down here. 544. Not bad, not bad. Mm. Come on, Moscovy. You can do it. Also, uh, right over here. Let's do this a bit earlier than last time. Let's actually pause here. Get that uh, bonus to to uh, the monarch points. Rolling. <laughs> Recall. I want to have Ruthenian. Culture under us. Okay, mm -mm -mm. that was over. Did you do anything? Sh nope. Oh, God, you did make them break the alliance. But did you did wreck them a bit. Well, very little. 107. 243 237 okay hmm try that man I I'm not sure if it would be better if they had said yes to that. Uh, Commonwealth. Neutral. Why are you neutral? Please be friendly. Threatened. Nope. Oh, what? Who? Right. Uh, hmm. God damn it. That's not the war that <laughs> the the order can win. I'm afraid. So who hates Poland? Hungary, Teutonic Order, Bohemia. By diplomatic reputation, if Lithuania became weaker, or if they liked me a bit more, then we sort of kept out there. If you all what the hell were you going? Recall. I don't know, I guess we could try and 
perhaps send a diplomat down to the Ottomans. Don't think we'll gain anything from it, but I'm willing to try anything, basically. Now, if you gathered all of your armies, you might stand a chance. Okay, that got... <laughs> then you got stack wiped. Okay, great. Then no, forget about it. strength. Who started this war? Lithuania. Okay. Conquest. Do they get a bunch of claims? Oh, yeah, they do. That they do. I guess I can try here. Oh, wait, what? They already integrated the... Uh, the Moldovia? Jesus. That must be some kind of, bit of, uh, of event, right? I can't do it that fast. They just got them. Hmm. Crazy. Very crazy. They could do that. Province modifier. Okay. Mercenary cars, legitimacy, garrison size, global modifier. That's pretty damn good, actually. Lithuania, <laughs> if we want to do anything here. Rikurvich. Do an air. He is better by two points, so that's something. Uh, compared to a curd rod. Mm, pardon me. been a long day. Okay. You don't want to now. I think still Moscow is our best bet, but they don't really like us. I guess they need to... I think once they've integrated a few of their vassals, they would be more willing to do anything, something with us. Right now they have way too many relations. Minus four. Forty, I mean. And it should be just four to four, right? And they have one too many. I guess. Raishan. No, two. No. Yeah. One too many. Two, two too many, I think. Yeah. So, I think every one you're above limit gives a minus, um, minus 20. So, that would make sense. So, if they integrate one of their underlings here, it should be better. Okay, please continue this war for as long as possible. To bleed and ruin Lithuanians. Lithuanians stay. Lithuanians stay. Uh, okay. Alright. Okay. Hmm. That we could try and maybe curry favors with them, with the Muscovites. Turn core provinces. No, we can't do that when we. I think when we're vassal, maybe not. Hmm. Uh oh, sure. Wow. 
Oh, but you didn't give anything to Poland. Please break the alliance. It'd be great if you did. Galicia, Volhynia. Okay, hmm. let's just uh, try different ones here. Maybe someday it will stick with someone. Must be right. No. Must be a great power? Yeah, just barely. Five points behind. Fierce Negotiator. Oh well, at least it's not bad, so that's something. Hmm. Seven out of seven. So, could still develop. Wait, how did we get an extra tax modifier? Event? It must be an event. We could develop a Kiev for a bunch of extra points. Like 50% more <laughs> than usual, because we're vassal. Just to give ourselves a boost and also the ability to build a larger army. Uh, to some extent, at least. We will be getting behind on tech, though. Mm. That would suck a lot. It's a bit of a... Well, it's a bit of a chance either way, what we, what we, whatever we're going to do here. We're going to try the same thing as before, just hoping someone would like to assist us. Oh, you would like to assist us. Ooh, come on. Because you devoured one of your dudes, right? No, well, I don't know. Regardless, you're fine with this. Teutonic Order. Mm. Oh, you're not right. Not really just, yeah. I don't think the Mamelux is a good a good option here. Denmark could perhaps be it, but they haven't rivaled yet. Well, they have rivaled Denmark, but not the other way around. Scotland. Hmm. Maybe if Scotland got wrecked a bit by England, it would work. I do have Sweden and Norway under them. And they're both loyal right now, so that could be a nice boost trying to move in towards Novgorod. And Muscovy f helping us. Or oh, the Ottomans, but I don't think they're. I think they're a bit too powerful. Lithuania. Oh, that's good. Uh, where's that? Right here. Green. I think I actually want manpower. So we can get maybe a higher force limit at some point. The earlier the better. Though, we do need an income as well. To be able to support our army. Mixing out in diplomatic, all right. Hmm. <sighs> oh, minus ten here. Nice. Okay, do this. Oh, they killed them already. Hmm. Okay, let's send someone over to Denmark. Denmark, find someone else. Scotland is allied with France, okay. York. Come home. Just 
top this off for the lols. Phone's beeping. Is the phone my phone? Means me to cut, but can to play a bit longer. Doing the waiting game here. Just need someone to support us. That would be optimal. The call. Hmm. Let's top this one off as well. Okay, that's only a couple of ticks. Osmanoglu, you are so good. 646. Okay, we're gonna take the manpower. Mm. Okay. Are you at war over here? Yes, you are. Kassan, Kramira, and Uzbek. Okay. Grant aid? Ah, uh, crap. But okay. Alright. 80. Hmm. Damning. The state needs the money though? Well, yes and no. I also need the prestige to be honest. I think I'll do this. Okay, I need a strong Muscovy. So please end this war sooner rather than later. If we do a uh, war against Novgorod again. Oh, nice. Okay, gained a hundred here. That's fine. About to max out in two things. Six, seven, six. Okay, do that. I guess we'll do this as well. Not ahead. Luca. Teutonic mm. order. Sure. Crap. Mm. Just biding our time, it's a bit slow. Denmark, if you rivaled Lithuania, that would be cool. Oh, you did. Oh, huh? Ah. Hey, come on, come on. All right, all right. Denmark, Sweden is still loyal. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Hey, we need to f have this war to be finished and Moscovy to be in somewhat battle ready ready state before doing anything. And the last one is still Mamluks, right? No. Oh, yes, but also the Great Horde. Interesting. Interesting. I wouldn't mind them helping as well. Just to... What do you call it? Shadow Kingdom. Uh, distract Lithuania and Polish troops. And Novgorodian... Nov Novgorodian troops. Call. Cool. Okay. Port Teutonic Order. Hmm. Uh, treasury. You still have that uh, crazy fella? No. Skanderberg. Hmm. Not anymore. Let's top this off. Could you f finish your little war? That would be great if you did, Muscovy. Oh. Yes. Psst. Uh, yes? Why are they all saying yes? Eh, no. 
Well, I don't care about any of these. Lithuania, Poland, Novgorod, Stettin. That's fine. Uh, yeah, we'll pay the extra 10. Okay, I still need this war to end. Are you losing Muscovy? Damn. What is going on? Tch. You were the chosen one. Ugh. Uh, I still want Muscovy to, to be there. Top of the other dudes. That's already topped off. Karaman, uh huh. Okay, you find Teutonic Order again. You are taking it? No, come on, please, for the love of God, take it and end the war. Good. Surely you've turned this around. Eh. You still need 10 points to be able to get some kind of peace deal. At least, where you take something from them. But I mean, really? Okay, did peace out Kramira. Okay. Well, the hordes are decently strong at the start of the game. They have some good, some good cavalry. Running a boot. We need to do this before Sweden gets too angsty and uh, not willing to help or anything. No, wait, what? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. If I did this. They would be forced into the war. Okay, you're not at war. You're not at war. You're not at war. Ugh. <sighs> Come on, finish it! You epic fool. I'll need your, divi your attention down here, uh, totally. Okay, well, that's fine. We got our guarantees or support for independence. That he took Moscow. <laughs> Ugh, boy. How powerful is uh, ye old Muscovy? Um, would they? No. Would they pop up here? They're probably 21. Yeah. Oof. Not good. Poland? Oof. Mamluks, though, pretty decent. Oh, damn, Kazan. Hmm. Oh. Is that a white piece? I think while they're busy with the uh, no guy as well. You also sort of busy, not that busy though. I think I have to do it. I don't think it's. I don't think it will go well for us, but. Ah, really? Hoping that uh, he's hoping that uh, Mamluk can actually get up here. Do that. Uh, 
cool. Vinica, well, I can just look yeah, here. It's a very small province. What the? Strelsi? Oh! Uh, let's do manpower. Oh, crap. I guess we can go up here and hide <laughs> in this uh, sieging army. Oh, hello, Mamluks, you did arrive. Though... You need uh, more troops, really. Okay, Poland went over there with an army. Tonagor is still alive. Uh, nice. I'm gonna yeet out of here. Or we'll just take some stuff. Get a few more points. Peace out, Novgorod. That'd be great. Okay. Oh, they're uh, oh they're landing with the uh, with ships. Oh, I mean, yeah, naval landing. Huh. Oh, could you save uh, Kiev? Nope, could not. Retaking stuff down here, so that's good. Oh, thanks, Hijaz. Mm -mm -mm. Can you take that? That'd be great. Good, good. Demand all rights? Uh, nah, that's okay. Okay, Muscovy seems to think <laughs> a lot of this stuff is theirs. Uh, well, I would like to get a hold of this province here. Thanks. 30k army, nice, nice. Once more into the breach, uh, yeah. Do that. Grab that as well. For our own good. Hmm. Army's up here fighting Swedish troops, that's fine with me. I'm not gonna give Moscovy anything. They are potential or future enemy at least, but I guess they're useful for now. Obviously. I'm not sure I want to border the K Ottomans yet. And if the Ottomans attacks the Mamluks, I'm not sure I want to help either. Truth be told. Alright. 
good, good, good. Florence, sure. I suppose we can go here and help. Make sure they take it. Couldn't we also peace out Poland? Okay, they're seizing stuff in Scandinavia. Fine with me. Take it? No. There will be blood, obviously. Podole? Sure. I guess we do want Podol. It's part of Podolia here. If we can take that from Poland. They're not co belligerent, so. Have to be a bit careful. Uh, Novgorod is me. Did you ever take Nov. No! <laughs> Weren't you like super close? But doing this is. Fine. Sure. Focus on the stuff that matters instead. Take time. Yeah. Right. Eh, go ahead and sit on something here. Poland would like to peace out, bro. Eh, we could probably do that. Uh, let's take this here. Poland is low. Okay, give me that. Ah, they're not. Oh, okay. Not offer tribute. Are you insane? Okay, so we. Mm, we don't want to separate piece out Poland then, I guess. So that's a bit annoying. Well, getting put away is not that important actually. We will take it later. We'll make them break the alliance with. Wait, what? I can't make them break a lot. Did I? Should it be in here? What? Huh. Never mind then, just do that. Uh, go home. Ruthenian, Belarusian. Okay. Uh, wait with that a bit. I'm guessing we're just gonna wait for. Uh, maxed out here. Well, or close at least. Okay, good. Well, Stetten. Uh, coin. Sure. And 99, that's fine. Oh, right. Uh, independence first. All right. Stop being allied to Poland. Right. Then a bit of land. I didn't. Uh. I didn't promise you anything.
Should I? Keeping a. Uh... Oh, with one. Ten. Who's occupying? Oh. If I did something like, uh, let's see, Muscovy. Muscovy. Having Muscovy being happy is sort of important, I think. So we'll, yeah, we'll do that. Mm, nice. Sweet. Sweet deal. One of the following is, oh right, admin 10 first. Right, right. We can afford here. I'm not sure what that fort, so let's delete it. Um, let's do this. Let's send uh, Royal Mares to Russia. Moscovy. Denmark? Mm, sure. Uh, yeah, sure. Crimea? Okay. Oh, damn. <laughs> Genoa. Doing stuff. Okay, we grew to over double size in development, so I guess that's good. Though still... still small. Very small. Aw. Trust. Yeah. Not surprising. I'm sorta of tempted to boost... Kiev. Well, need to state it right first, maybe? I don't know. I think I will do it. Mm. Yeah, not surprising there. Uh, fine. Bits will come there. Been warned. Okay. Yeah, just embrace. Alright, let's see here. Uh, Great Horde, not surprising either. Uh, go up to 10 for now. Need to keep you happy. For sure. Okay. Alright. Okay. Let's uh, get a few claims on this fella here. Bit annoying that <laughs> Genoa took all this stuff here. Uh, fine. War reps helping us out a lot right now. Hmm. Chernigov, Saproshi. Uh, I'll do this. Okay, sure. More favors from them is a good thing. Hmm. Ottomans. Okay. Maybe they will make them give back provinces to Crimea. That wouldn't be too bad, I guess, unless they are allied or not. Or maybe not. Maybe they'll just take it for, for themselves. So I don't want this to go down to zero before coring anything to save a bit of admin. 
Six, six, six. Right. Lump of the beast. Still haven't gotten a single event regarding authority. This will only grow in, as part of events, as far as I know. Okay, let's claim Mansoor. Some good icons here. Discipline. Construction cost down, development cost down. Because of expansion down. Yeah, they're all good in their own right. But in my opinion, you only want to do it once you're like lingering at uh, 95 or 100. And once you. Then you also get sometimes. Some, sometimes you get events where you lose some patriarch authority, but you gain some kind of bonus like lose inflation or plus one stability. So that's where you want to, if you're sitting at 100, go back 5 and then take an icon, use, or at 100, take an icon, go down, you know, just lingering up here. There's no bonus at being at 0. Well, of course, the Patriarchs has less influence, but... Yeah. Oh, the Cossacks. Developing step promises, governing costs. I don't think they can give any bonus to... Uh, oh, that's pretty good. Hmm. Should we do this? Yeah, you know what? Sure. That's pretty handy. Oh, I forgot to <laughs> take note. No cavalry, though, for us. Chihiv shift something. They could go there or here. Okay, they will go here, here. Let's just wait there. If they go down here, we'll go over here. Then they will only go back to Lublin. Yeah. Alright, go in, retake that. Just defend. They might get a crossing penalty. They should, at least. If I'm reading this map correctly. Let's also do this while we're just waiting. They should go back here. Oh, Estonian peasants, that's good. The truce here will probably only end in a long time. Would be my guess. Uh. There. 82, yeah. That's okay, that's okay. We take Poltava. The only other with Nogai. Would Nogai help? Yes. Okay. Luthania did warn us. But they're in real no position to do anything, really. Uh, do that. It's a Prussian. That's a Christian horde in these Saporoshi. Is it time? No, but soon. It's not very well developed, all these provinces, but it's flat. Well, steps kind of suck, but the others are pretty good. Grassland and farmlands. Oh, really? Ah, oh, Lithuania, okay. And uh, war, okay. Novgorod. Uh, call. Let's also do. Well, we don't really need that, so let's do, th do this. Mm. 
Uh, okay, one moth pole. Should probably build a cavalry. A bit of extra oomph. But we also need to cut, so thanks for watching. <laughs> Please do like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button. Very much appreciate your support. And a big extra thanks to my channel members Mike Murray, Tim Reno, Wisco Matt, Jeffrey Henderson, and Jonathan Crane, and Christoph Kroll. <laughs> thanks again. See you next time.